Hey everyone, welcome to Chapter 11, Blood Runs Red. Um, last time we broke out of jail, this time shenanigans will ensue. Cause, um, we got some units to mess around with in the base of operations. But also, this is one of the more, I guess, important is the best way to put it. It's a very, like, a lot of plot happens here. It's a pretty cool chapter, honestly. It's one of my favorites, like, plot-wise. Well, we're here. Welcome to Toha. Or Toha. Crimea's westernmost port city. What's with this place? The people aren't going about their business. Why are they worried about Dane? About the war? Because this, this area is fairly isolated. Dane's army hasn't come this far, and so life goes on as before. Dane's plan is to seize the capital. Then slowly and steadily, had Santa's interference and influence still controls everything. I'm sure these people have some idea what's happening. Ignorance is a form of bliss, is it not? These people don't know what it's like to lose a war. They don't want to know. Crimea as a nation has always been blessed by peace. Perhaps it's due to the temperament of its rulers, but the country hasn't seen serious warfare for centuries. Oh. The minor skirmishes with the Kingdom of Dane have been legion. Only the king eastern borderlands have taken damage. And even I know this peace will not last. When we meet Dane forces at our scouting mission, they attack our merely for being with the Crimean border. Humans are shameless creatures that have carelessly ignored any misfortune which is not to follow them directly. They can, and often do, their turn a blind eye to all manner of wickedness as long as it does not touch them or their kin. They will bow their heads, condemning those, vi those victims for bringing calamity upon themselves. And then, then they will cast their eyes towards heaven, thanks while the neighbors lay dying around them. I mean, that does fit to the real, real world, though. I mean, ignorance is truly bliss. But, we're, but the war is happening here. This is their home, not someone else's. When they an army darkens their doorsteps, perhaps they'll still understand. When the peace they take for granted is shattered, and their sons and daughters slaughtered in the streets, perhaps then they'll try to comprehend the misfortunes they so long to pretend not to see. I have no sympathy for them. Oh, I am reading today. I was able to get through those, no problem. Okay, I feel lucky. Oh, oh I just realized. My goodness, did I hear the truth? The blunder he goes. Uh, I guess because they were trying to cut out pieces over here, you can see that his like, his neck and the like where his hair would be, it's act it's not there, huh? My delightful staff officer, you have there. He's um, it's not enough little shoe severity in him, but but this something's bothering him, that's for sure. Maybe it was that you know javelin to his forehead. It's to be expected. Even I'm a bit shocked by this place. Can they truly be as placid as they appear? Soren's a very Soren's an empath. He just kind of knows the emotions. Uh. And Nori and Pen do because you cannot prevent it. Fatalism is by nature a disheartening beast. Well, for all those born of nothing, there are those born of everything. Perhaps those who never know the difference are the ones we should envy. What's that supposed to mean? Huh? Oh, I was just talking to myself. Pay me no mind. Just philosophy time. Hmm. Now then, I'm gonna man the sea. I, I gotta see man about a ship. I gotta man the sea later, though. That's you, Ike. <laughs> when I'm gone, why don't you get some I squared away? I'm sure the journey will help you quite a lot of hacking. Right off, I'll go with you. No, that's all right. You should supervise the supply acquisition. Be at sea for months, you know. I know that, but who is Atania? She's worried about me. She doesn't want to leave the solitary Lagoos wander around the Bjork City. I thought Crimea and the Galley were ally nations. Why do wandering Lagoos be cause for concern? Well, it shouldn't be, but do you remember what King Kanegas told you? Friendship between Crimea and Galley exists only between the ruling classes, and take root in the minds of the common citizens tree is all. That being said, things have improved quite a bit since King Ramon ascended to the throne. Courts of Hunts and others such orders have almost disappeared. Oh, don't worry, I'll be fine. I've got connections, see? It's not like I'll be roaming for the Oxford Badgeman for passage. Alright then, the job is yours, be careful. You too, don't mess anything up. And summary, yeah, a lot of enemies left was the MVP. In interesting. No casualties, man, per and no one suffered permanent interestingly. Yeah, and that's rare for us, apparently. Okay, what supports are open? Nothing that I'm interested in. Okay. Let's first off to show about, you know, how racism is still a thing. Pardon me, buddy. I haven't seen you around here before. You were a traveling mercenary? Yeah, so I suppose you could say that. Nice sword. You look like a man who knows his business. If you're looking for your work, I've got a proposition for you. A proposition? I'm in a vigilante group that helps our ta fair town safe. A strong man like you would be most welcome. Thanks, but I've got something lined up. Oh, really? That's too bad. Heading off the sea? Maybe. <laughs> just carry to the end. I like that. Well, just in case you are, I want you to have this. Hmm? What's this? It's a special sword. It'll come in handy if you ever find yourself at sea. That the D would. <laughs> huh. Really? You're giving me a sword? Are you sure? Well, there is one condition. Once you finish your job, you come back and see me. So can I'd like you to consider that vigilante position. Understood. Thanks again for the blade. Lagoo Slayer. It's a little heavy-handed, but also it's effective against lagoos. That is true. It's like a, it's like a hammer, but for lagoos. Is it fucked up that humans have created an item that can is specifically made to kill goose? Yes. 
Yes, it is. Hey there, traveler. Do you have everything you need? You stop at my humble shop, and we'll find the best deals in town. What do you say? Interested? Yeah, that sounds great. Listen, can I ask you a question? No problem. You ask me anything, especially if it's not my low, low prices. What do the townspeople think of Dane? Didn't anyone think to flee to Crimea? Flee? Don't be absurd. But Crimea lost the war. Yeah, no, and honestly, that doesn't really affect the common folk, you know? The truth is, we don't care who sits on the throne. To us, they're all just faceless beings who rule from on high. If they try to raise taxes or something, you better believe we pro you best believe we protest, but otherwise. I mean, take the King of Dane. Just another man, right? If we keep working, he can li keep living the high life. It's not like he's gonna going to treat us prop poorly or anything. So we can live our lives and have a little happiness, we aren't gonna much We aren't gonna worry all too much about it. Oh, but if we were made by Gallia, well, well that's a different story altogether. Them there, Mexicans, I mean Gallians. Who knows what gonna happen? What the hey, hey come back. What about my low, low prices? No, no, that's what I was all about. Yeah. I mean, I've heard people say that racism in this game is a little heavy-handed, but also it's racism. In real life, it's heavy-handed. It affects fucking people all the time. Don't complain. Hmm. Princess. My Lord Ike. Were you here all by yourself? That's not very safe. I, I was looking at town. I'm familiar with the world outside the Imperial Villa where I was raised. This is the first time I've been able to see how other people live. Everything is so new and different to my eyes. This is a town, isn't it? There's so much energy and everyone seems to be enjoying themselves. With all the boats coming in out of the harbor, the town's livelier than most, that's for sure. It's like nothing's happened. All the death and destruction we've seen feels like a horrible dream. Hmm. Yeah, that's pro That's good, Alencia. Sure, that feels good. Ha! <laughs> yeah, ha, uh, yeah! What are you doing? I'm trying to gain the superior physique when I lost when I was held prisoner. Are you ready to board the ship? I was born ready. <laughs> I don't need anything. Even though as he speak, many of my fellow Dane Crimeans are suffering at the hands of Dane. I cannot rush to the raid today, but then I compare myself with anyone I can. I see. Well, when you're ready, I'll let you know. Understood. Sorry to have interrupted you. My Lord Ike. What is it? You are giving care for Princess Lincia. You have my heartfelt thanks. She, for all of us, is our one solitary hope. Yeah. Right, enough talking. So to make a trouble with your I can just keep training. Ha! Huh. Yeah? Wah! Careful. Don't pull anything. Hmm. What are you looking at? Oh, just this. This is sort of good luck charm. My family gave it to me when I left home. We never had much money, so my parents gathered some stones from our farm back home and put this in a leather pouch. It's not much to look at, but it means a lot to me. Every day I take them out and talk to them like they're my family. Who is everyone? I'm out here doing the best I can. Don't worry, I'll be home soon. Just stuff like that. I know it sounds foolish, but if I don't do this, I won't. I won't have the courage to fight. Don't worry about my feelings. You can laugh acting like this at my age or the silly man I am. It's not silly, Brom. Your strong man just had to fight for the sake of his family. And your family is proud of you. Hmm. Thank you, Mike. Thank you. Brom is such a sweet character. He's such an adorable boy. Oh, man. Just what a great family man. Well, what's that? Are, are we to go, Anthony? Ah, 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 Ike. What is it? Um, no, nothing. I'm fine. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah, uh, sure, I'm sure. You know, it's hell being held prisoner. It's still mentally demanded. I need to know. Can you fight? Not a problem. It's easy for you to say, but you sound like you're about to fall over. That on, no, that's just a habit. It's just the way I talk, just talking. Uh, sorry. No need to apologize. As long as you're not feeling ill, everything's fine. Alright, see you later. But right then. And I'm gonna be back with battle preps because I have shenanigans. Although, the main shenanigan. Um, where are my prisoners? I mean, recruits. Prisoners. Okay. She, uh, okay. Nephany has E rank, Braum has D rank. And they don't come with weapons, because why would they? But she does use the arm scroll well, so she can, like, use better weapons. So I will be immediately um, using this on her. And I guess I can't use this immediately? Oh, whatever. Okay, I'm going to be back when battle preps are done. Alright, we are done with battle preps. Shenanigans have been had. And you guys will see my biases very soon. We should be leaving, but... Because everyone's got a while yet. My lord, Ike, are you ready to go? Me? i am always got my sword as I'm always ready. A sword, that's it. I've got my cake, I can see you out just about everywhere. It's her food well. Something always turns up. <laughs> that's delightful. It is? Yes, very much so. <laughs> Princess. It's princesses. Women. <laughs> no, just kidding. <laughs> can, I need to find... What's going on? What are the excitement? My lord, Ike, if there's a crowd guy in the town entrance, that's... If I wasn't busy tomorrow... I would definitely try to find a sound, like, effect. 
but ten hours is a huge day for me. Attention, citizens! We've received, we've received reports of crime and army stragglers hiding in this town. From this point forth, today Amari will blockade all points of entry. No one comes or goes without our leave. The harbor is also closed. No ships will be allowed to set sail. I think troops have... I know. All we can do is move towards the docks to try not to be discovered. Have you seen Randolph? Not yet. Wait, here it comes now. Randolph, over here. Ooh, things are heating up, aren't they? Everything's at your end. Everything's set. All you need to do is sneak down the harbor. Man, there a man by Dusky Palor. His name is Nasir. Nasir is a man you can trust. I've explained your situation to him. He's willing to help. If you can reach the ship safely, he'll take care of everything and deliver to Banyan. Randolph, are you coming too? I was planning on it, but things move with some concern. I'll stay behind and see what's going on. Ugh. Oh, I'm sorry. I was watching where I was going. No, pardon me. Ah. Uh, 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 subhuman. Blast. It's true, a subhuman. How do you come prowling around here? Ugh. <laughs> That's more than smite. We need an old man on our fucking army. That's three fucking tiles. These dissing stuff humans you learn in your place. Human sounds good too for you. One of my low low prices. Ew, it's so hairy. Go on, scat. This is beyond fucked up, by the way. We just got we just saw a hate crime and did nothing about it. Mordecai. I must leave. But now we have to help Ranoff. All this noise will attach it. Check the attention to Dame troops. That's why you have to go here help. Help me fine. Leave him. Randolph is strong. Even stronger than me. It is alright. Randolph is no attention to defending himself. Like he's not even changing forms. You're standing there watching to get murdered? Ike, wait. Idiot. Human. Stop. Get out of my way. Keep your hands off my boyfriend. Who do you think you are? Run around leaving scars. He friend this monster. I saw them talking earlier. What's that to you? Yeah, the primary regard is subhuman commanders, don't they? You're one of those army guys the troops are searching for. You there. Dane soldier. Ho. I'm a ho. Don't talk to me, sir. Also, man, your your poor genetics. You just look naturally evil with those fucking crow eyes. Or crow's feet. Hey, that way, hurry. Are you mad? Your king was murdered by Dane. They're gonna cooperate with them? Well, um... The king, the king was dead with those subhumans. That's one of them killed. Yeah, that's right. If we need allies, we'll take flesh and blood he Dane humans over some faint subhuman freak. Yeah, yeah, that's less, at least we know what we're getting. Trust our own kind. People are insane. Yeah, angry Ike. Pull out angry Ike for the racism. Or a subhuman everyone's screaming about. Huzzah, the Toa Vigilantes are here. These guys have driven over to Dane Army, and I'll prove their allegiance game in our field's favor. Ha uh ha. -huh. One subhuman hunted down, and I'm your man. Ike. Randall, are you okay? Why did you come back? Because some fool was going to lay here and get beaten to death instead of defending himself. Uh, Ike. What do you have me to do? Galleon crime before an alliance. Like, not jeopardize that by harming these people, no matter what ill they bear me. Don't let them care two figs for their own country? Even if, there's sins of crime here after all. Well, I'm not Galleon, so there's no reason for me to hold back. Ike, listen to me. They think you and I are allies. If you attack, there's no different than I, than if I do myself, so... Let me guess, you're telling me to avoid the Dane pursuit, leave the town of the Vigilantes alone. Get to the docks as soon as possible and find a man named the Seer and get everyone in Is that it? Exactly, I don't care what everyone else says. I think you're pretty bright. What? What? Hey, that's not going to do us any good. Sandy, it's Get everyone together. We're getting out of here. Alright. That's a lot of enemies. And also a lot of things that they want us to do this chapter that I don't know if I can. Alright. Choose units. Everyone minus Mia, I guess. Which is... I don't know. Ralph's kind of sucks. I feel like I'd rather want Mia than him. But yeah, all you have to do is just arrive. Arrive to this point, which is pretty simple. Actually, I might... I mean, what's your... Just because I feel like you might have better chances of, like, helping out than Volk, I'm going to bring you over him. I don't think there's anything to steal particularly. I don't think. You can just steal all the heal staves, though. I don't really need the heal staves now, per se. Nothing to steal, I don't think. That's so many fucking enemies. Oh, yeah, you're here. Oh, well, am I kidding who you're here? You're here. Yeah, he that was the plan. Okay. So, there are vigilantes, and it's really hard to keep them alive, honestly. But I just need to get um, one of my furries over there, and I should be golden. Which might involve murder. But you know what? You gotta do what you gotta do. Now, for the rest of you, um, just storm to the left, to the right. I mean, not to the right. Um, these vigilantes are going to be a problem, but luckily we have a Braum, so we should be fine. 
I might actually keep you three back here just to kill these guys so they're not a nuisance later. Also, yeah, people are off on the side, and I think we're golden. Let's go. Listen to Kree. Don't know the single Crimean gra soldier escape our grasp. Sleep the entire town, arrest anyone suspicious. General McQuire, sir, the group of vigilantes want to help us. Shall I, what should I tell them? Hmm, very well. Let them do as they please. Yes, sir. What are we going to time wise, anyways? Ooh, god, okay. I know a lot that was battle preps, but still, pardon me. Are you the commander of these forces? I am, and who are you? I'm tapping on the boat you moored here. My name is Nasir. I saw they accomplished some brief bit. Some brief pieces of business, but your soldiers are now preparing to set sail. I need to leave this place. I apologize for the inconvenience. However, we're trying to stop the Crimean soldiers from escaping. So, like, shut the fuck up, please. My ship is a simple merchant vessel. Sailing under the flag of the Benyon Empire. For essential documentation, surely it will provide no size whatsoever to Crimea. Vain rules, such Benyon papers are nothing more than fish wrap. Yet. You call yourself Nasir, right? Perhaps you protest too loudly, Nasir, being your Crimean sympathizer. Or happen, who knows what my unfortunate fate might happen to your simple merchant ship. I see, so be it. Bitch. You there, soldier. Sir. Showing the watch on the ship, that man is up to something. No matter what happens, that ship must be off you'll set sail. Burn him here first. Yes, sir. Also, yes, we've seen this here earlier. He was in the town where we fought the pirates originally. Now then, where's our special guest? Jesus has joined the server, or God himself. Say, you know, I don't know. I'm right here, General McCoya. Oh, Sir Black Knight, I hope you didn't keep you waiting. No, I just arrived. Let us proceed. I would hear your reports. There are problems whatsoever, and nothing to report. Say the tedium of it all. The farther west we travel, the fear, the weaker the Crimean fighting spirit becomes. These shall displace less and less resistance. Now that really don't wide the gates open to the sign of our approach. Beating a hunch on like this, however, my troops might become sloppy and lose their edge. A fellow warrior, I can sympathize with your plight. I thank you for understanding. This sounds not scheduled for subjugation until much later. Tell me, why are you here now? Yes, as of that. More than years ago, a castle that held Crimean prisoners of war was attacked and the crap was freed. Perpetrators are Crimean soldiers coming in by subhumans. Prince of Intelligence reports the trail led here. I see. Prince of Gal Crimea said to flood to Gallia. From the capture of this band, we may gain information on the location. Do require my assistance. I think you for the generous offer. However, if you were under afraid, I think it would be over in a twinkling. The men are starved for a combat. I beg you to restrain so they may feel out some entertainment. As you will. Field is yours. Turn your soldiers loose and may their blades run red with glory. Rage of is greatly appreciated. Alright. And Ranulf is here. Good luck, Ike. You'll be fine. As for me, I think I'll play a little game of cat and mouse with these dang fools. Get it? I'm a cat. Fall the furry! Everyone, move for that harbor. Try to avoid a conflict in the local Atlantic group if you can. Let's go. Okay. Now, for the vigilantes, they're much weaker units. I can realistically avoid those guys. Um, these ones though, I don't know. I don't know how they want you to deal with them because you need to recruit an, a unit over here. So I'm just gonna have to, you know, pull out the good old one-two murder probably. Which yes, it does kind of suck, but I mean, what do? I don't have much of a choice. Even if I smite him, he's still in the way. So yeah, Marsha, don't feel bad about this. They're racist. It's okay. And then let's bring up the philosophical question. Is it okay to murder racists if they're vigilantes? You lose out on bone experience, but I mean, probably. All right. That, they also give no experience, so like, there's legitimately no reason to kill them if you don't need to. I just want to make sure I can get this to Hark really quick so I don't fuck up. Ah. Gary, a Crimean. I cannot fight you. Hold on, please. I'm not enemy of the Lagoos. Lagoos? How do you... I drove my engine because I knew it would before me a chance to scalp you flee. Listen, I'll let you out the town, people. While they're worried about me, you can make your escape. I cannot trust a word of a human. I see, well. If I cut down these vigilantes, will you believe me? Huh? One, two, all of them? How many do you want? Just give me the word and I'll start cutting. It's quiet. Why would you? I want to help. That's all. Hmm. I see, you're not an enemy. That much I believe. Thank you. Now we must hurry away from this place. No, I cannot flee. I have f friends. Hmm. Who might spread their ship? I need to desist. It's much dangerous. The vigilantes didn't want nothing more than to kill the goose. I'm not leaving. I see. If that's your stance, I have no choice. Hmm? I'll return to your group. Don't, don't be ridiculous. What's your name? I am Lef, but that's a good name. That's beside the point you... I am Zahark. Well met, Lef. Whoops. I don't think we have time for formal instructions. Let's hurry. Hold it. I have not agreed to this. Stop being nice. Okay. 
Now, what is your range? Because I am a tad worried. Zyhark is my, um... Okay, just in case, how much damage do you fuckers do? Okay, that, you might do a little bit to me. So... Okay. 9 plus... What's your attack? 15 versus my 7 defense. Can you guys do nothing to me? Okay. I'm good to kill this man early on. So Zyhark is going to be my Merm of choice. I think he's really cool. Um, the only thing he lacks is apparently in his official art. I'm pretty sure he lacks some ass because, like, there's nothing there. But that's the only detract I could think of for him, honestly. I mean, he's a really cool character, and he's one of my favorites in Talius. I like how he really is, like, for lack of a better term, kind of, like, such a freedom fighter, you know? It's just such a cool character. I really enjoy him. Use this arm scroll, please, Nephany. Both, so I get bonus experience. I have my biases. They both level up pretty good. Um, okay. I need to find a way to get you guys without instantly murdering you both. But for now, I think... Um, okay. I should have probably given you the forge. That made my life a little easier, I imagine. But you know what? It's too late for that now. Worst case, I can get a kill with Rolf. Everyone's favorite character, Rolf. Alright, here and move this way, I think. No. How do I not kill this man? I swear, the Vigilantes are just in such annoying positions. They're just hard to keep alive. Rolf, get your kill. Good job, queen. Slay another day. Also, yes, he still sucks. I, there's not much I can do about that. Rolf's just gonna kind of be bad for for the duration of his time in this army. Although, I can probably rescue... I mean, what I could do... Yeah, I can do that. Alright. Rescue Rolf out of here. Please, because Mordecai... Mordecai is just that good. Also, you can still... Sm you can smite a cavalier in it. Like, that's crazy. That's wild. Um, you guys all have physical weapons, so... Titania, just kind of stay behind and kill them, please. Good. I'll take it. Now, unfortunately... Maybe... Does Mia not kill? Okay, Mia not killing for once is going to be useful. Because then I can lure them around. Oh, fuck. I don't... I don't know. I think it's just better to murder them, right? Like, is it morally abject? It probably. But, I mean, at least I can shove with mist, so... It's not all bad. It's just mostly bad. Um... Just shove, why not? Also, I never really mentioned it. We'll, we'll do it next turn when I have the chance to mention it, because it just makes more sense. Eight damage. That's a good chunk, but... That's not too bad. Alright. Just because I feel like they're going to be a little annoying if I had to keep, you know... Nice. Maybe that's Rolf experience. Maybe I should be looking at the Vigilante a different way. They're not bonus experience, but they're just regular experience. Good miss. She's dodged a lot, Nephany. She got some good levels, though. I'm hoping Nephany is going to be a good unit for me. She, Nephany is my bias unit. Is Nephany the best unit in the army? No. Dude, crap. That's my, that's my fucking killing edge. I just realized. Like, I'd say if you're playing optimally, Nephany is not the best investment. But I just love Nephany a lot, so I'll be using her. And I've never used the other unit that I've put some um, shenanigans into as well. I've seen people use Kieran. I've never actually used Kieran myself, but I've seen great results. So I might have been, end up using Kieran. Um, the rest, though, I don't know. I don't know where they're gonna lie. There we go. Uh, everyone just keep following me. Set me free. Just remember, we'll escape from the city. Okay. Oh, well, I mean, this is just a traffic jam, ain't it? Also, those guys will try to destroy the villages, as he's end up doing. But yeah, Braum, he has the Meg, because, you know, Radiant Dawn. Um, Braum is gonna be one of my... Not my best unit, probably ever, but I like Braum, and I want to give him a chance. 
Plus, we've lost a lot of units, and I think having a dedicated tank is probably a, a good investment. Okay, I'm just going to kill these vigilantes. You guys are kind of in the way. And is it petty to kill him just because you're annoying me at the, the current moment? A little. But also, I'm okay. Who cares? There we go. Please. Pick them off a little bit. Because if I can get the... I mean, you, get, you won't steal from me. So as long as I can block off this two-way, I should be fine. And you can't do that because you're in a weird spot. Can Marsha do anything from her position? Not particularly, unless I had to weaken up this man. Which, you know, I feel like Marsha's probably more used down there. But maybe she could chip in and get a kill of Zyhark. No, never mind. Okay, well, she can stand there and be pretty. And I can be careful with whatever turns left us here. I don't remember what turn the Burger King shows up, but I think I want to say turn three or four. So she needs to move eventually from that position. Luckily, you survive around the combat with this man. So just stand by the village. What's that? Thieves are taking advantage of the town's condition? The sack of the gate for your health. Oh, that's cross. Please take this a token for things. Take it. Killer lands. Hey, that's a good weapon. All right. Marsha, I... Def yeah, you're kind of there right now. All my, like, super good units are kind of in the back. Because I... I done fucked a little bit. So, yeah. Although, maybe I can... I mean, the hope is at least I can... How the fuck am I going to do this? Rolf, can you do any damage to these people? No. Okay, fine. Rolf, you're going to have to just kill this vigilante. Which I don't want to. Mordecai has enough to be A-OK -okay doing effectively anything. Although, I mean, Titania can't do much this chapter. I mean, this turn either, so I might as well, like, Iron Axe it up, right? Or Steel Axe it up. Take care of a soldier while I'm here. Okay, good. Good. How far north can you move? Not that north. Okay. Um... I, armor... Armor Slayer versus this man? I mean, is it obtuse? Yes. Do I gotta do it anyways? Probably. Okay. This looks silly, but I'm doing this so I can move forward. <laughs> yes, that does involve that mean that I'm now putting Mia up in the front lines uh, there, but whatever. I don't have a choice anymore, I guess. This would be a good man to kill. Sadly not, though. And Oscar? I mean... I mean, this could be useful, right? It's not a two-way we're blocking, but at least like a three-way. Better than nothing, right? Okay. Now smite Ike. God, I feel like a... <laughs> I feel like a paladin in a D&D campaign, just constantly smiting people. Okay. Um... Or is Nephany probably? Okay, Nephany, you can't really kill here, unfortunately. But Braum can. So I think I'll put Braum here. Okay. Oh, now you can't heal with Mist this turn. That's a little annoying. Well, I mean, Oscar's fairly tanky. He should be good. I hope. How much damage do you take from those guys? Uh, too much. And you don't even kill either. Maybe I should have taken that support. Uh, well. Well, I mean, I can... I can at least get that guy out of the way. Or actually, maybe I want to keep him here. He doesn't have pass. But Ike here, maybe he can draw some wins. And Nephany too. This wasn't my best chapter. I mean, turn. You know what I mean. Oh, good, going for Ike. Alright, that might have saved Oscar's life by some silly AI. 
Especially if... No, okay. Oscar... Okay, never mind. Oscar is perfectly fine. This was... This was totally deserved and valid. Not just a spur of the moment. Whoopsie daisy. The enemy did fuck up. Do not double crit or some shit. <laughs> nice. Okay. Thank you, RN Jesus. That was not deserved, but I'll take it. Strength, speed, defense, res. Look at that. Good level on him. Good job, kiddo. Yes, Kieran did not like that. That was a lot of damage. Okay. And Mia. Okay. Well, we just, I think we killed all the vigilantes. So I guess I don't need to deal with them anymore. That's a positive, I guess. We've committed mass murder. Take that as you will. Okay. Um, do you guys all have one range? Yes, you do. Okay. Now, luckily, because there is a fence here, and this game does actually have, like, 3D stuff, I'm gonna block off Cyhark, and then heal him. Yes, this is happening. And I will see you guys next time for more Path of Radiance, where I figure out this clusterfuck and how I'm gonna beat it. Alright, like, comment, subscribe. Bye, everyone.